What's going on everybody, FJC here, back with another BattleBit video. Today's video is more of a discussion video and I wanted to get your guys' opinion on the current state of the leveling system in BattleBit Remastered. It was no secret that before the XP change in BattleBit Remastered that it required a lot of grinding to even reach level 70 to get the vector. Prior to the XP change, I reached first prestige level 70 and I can definitely say it was a grind. Now I'm second prestige level 70 again and this time around it was way easier and way quicker to get to that level. So that's why I I made this video today because I wanted to get the community's opinion on whether or not the leveling system is too easy in BattleBit Remastered. This change was definitely needed prior to the XP change and correct me if I'm wrong on this in the comment section below but to get from level 0 to 200 it took 20 million XP. Now with the new XP changes it takes 2 million XP. So just based off those two stats you can tell definitely after the change it's way way easier and takes a lot less experience to level up to 200. I definitely agree with the reasoning behind the change for the XP. For the casual battle bit player who doesn't play the game every day or take the game very seriously, the leveling system was kind of a pain because of how long and how much of a struggle it was before. And because the leveling did take so long prior to the change, I feel like it turned a couple of people away from the game itself. If you stop playing battle bit for that reason, I definitely recommend coming back to the game to give it another shot because the leveling system definitely works on your side now. Prior to the change, going from level 0 to 15 to get the AK-15, which is the first first viable weapon in my opinion in the game that you unlock and when I say that I mean excluding the weapons you start with it would have taken at least two full matches depending on how many kills or how many people you revive or what score you get in the game to reach at least level 15. I prestiged the day prior to recording this commentary and I already reached level 70 in one day. In one match, I went from level 0 to level 25. So it's no doubt that the leveling system has definitely changed for the better, but my concern is that now it's way too easy to level up. The reason I say that is because if I was to dedicate 8 to 10 hours a day to playing this game, or even 12 hours playing the game, I would be able to get to level 100 without a doubt. So technically, I'd be able to prestige in two days, and with the current state of battle bit, after prestige 3, there's no weapon skins or prestige bonuses. So anybody who would pass prestige 3 which is pretty easy to do now would be waiting for more content to be released into the game which they've already discussed adding more prestige bonuses that don't include keeping weapons but are different and new weapons for the game have been leaked so until the next major update we'll wait to see what prestige bonuses will be eligible to get and as for the new weapons i'm very curious at what levels they're going to let you unlock them at i wonder if certain weapons will only be able to be unlocked if you've reached a certain prestige for example they're adding the an94 into the game so you can unlock the an94 at first prestige level 15 to bring more variety to the leveling system and also give people a reason to prestige if they're sitting at level 200 that goes further than just weapon camos in battle bits current state i see a lot of people sitting at level 200 because they don't see a reason to prestige just for weapon camos so in my opinion when the new weapons are released i think that they should put a prestige requirement on certain weapons like i stated earlier in my example instead of unlocking a weapon at a random level level like level 50 it would be first prestige level 15 for a certain gun so definitely let me know what you guys think of the leveling system and let me know your opinions on what i have to say in this video this video is meant to be more of a discussion video so i genuinely do want to hear your opinions in the comment section below like i've mentioned in other previous videos my clan kintsugi or cracked is currently hosting a recruitment challenge for anybody who's interested in playing battle bit competitively to have the crack tag in game you don't have to be a competitive player with us just join the clan discord and head on over to the clan in section and put the code that's in there in game to anyone interested in competitive play head on over to the clan recruitment forum channel in the discord and you'll see a paragraph that was written by me to sum the paragraph up we ask you for a one to three minute clip -tage and a screenshot of your stats we ask for both a clip -tage and stats because we understand that people may have had a slow start to the game so stats do not directly reflect how you play currently thank you guys for all the amazing support again on the recent videos in the channel as well as all the support on my twitch it's been amazing and i can't thank you enough. Once again, people, let me know your opinions in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, and have a great rest of your day.